we finally made it. <laughs> I think that is the box. Oh my days. As you know, in 2020, there was a huge boom in Pokemon, where everyone from Logan Paul, Gary V, and many more rediscovered their love and nostalgia for Pokemon. With so much attention on Pokemon and investing, this meant one thing, it got expensive. Cards tripled in value, seal box prices skyrocketed, and while anything with a Charizard, you might as well just add a few zeros to that figure, going from $5,000 to $400,000. Now, where do I come into all of this? Well, I've been a huge Pokemon fan since I was a kid, and like most people growing up, found other distractions that made me stop collecting Pokemon cards that I once loved doing in my childhood. However, in 2016, with the release of Pokemon Go, I started to rediscover my love for Pokemon cards again, and made it my mission to one day own something I dreamt of having when I was a kid, a base set booster box. And hopefully, pull again my favorite favorite card of all time the base set Charizard. The only problem at the time was that a base set booster box was going for around $30,000, which made this mission seem impossible. However, fast forward to 2022, I found a box that was going for half that price, and it seemed to me like a sign to take the plunge and achieve one of my childhood dreams. Yo, mum. Hi, son, how are you? I'm doing good, how are you? Yeah, not bad. What are you up to? Um, well, you know how I've always wanted to get a um, base set booster box? You know how much I've been going on about it for like, since I've been like 10? Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I might have just bought one. Oh, have ya? Yeah. Okay. Great. How much was that? Um, <laughs> between 10, uh, let's just say between 10 and $15,000. Hang up. <laughs> so now that I agreed to buy it, there was one slight problem. It was in America. Oh yeah, and I had to go pick it up. So I booked my flights, packed my bags, and took an eight hour flight across the world to go and collect my dream box. Okay, touchdown in New York. We have finally made it. And as you can see, we are in Central Park. We have the buildings, we are in the zoo right now. And I thought, Chloe, oh yeah, we have a sea lion as well. But I thought while we're here, let's do a pack battle. Yes. So let's try not to uh, fall down. Which, which pack do you want? I'm gonna go. You're going this one? <laughs> All right, I'll go first. And hopefully we can get something good. I mean, maybe the uh, sea lion might take a... I reckon <laughs> he could really take a Charizard. Like, <laughs> taking it all in. Like, right. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we have done it right. Let's see what we can get. Hopefully we can get something amazing. What do you reckon, Chloe? Who's winning this pack battle? Me I or mean, you? I'd like to say me, but... It's not the warmest in New York right now as well, but we're going to be continuing our journey. Ooh! Amazing rare. Amazing rare Veltal, or Y Vettel, however you want to pronounce it. And then a boss's orders. Right, okay. I'll I'll take go. that. Let's see what we can get. Should I, should I try and give it to him and see if he takes it? I was going to say, is he going <laughs> to... Right, coughing, more Pico, horsey. I can see something, Spinarak, Grookey. And a Cramorant. V. Not bad. I mean... Two good pulls. Yeah, not bad at all. Let's continue the journey. We're going to check out Summer Central Park and uh, then we're going to keep moving. And we did. We travelled further and further into America, stopping off at Walmarts, Targets and anywhere that sold Pokemon to see how different it was to the UK. And to be fair, some shops had some amazing stuff from Shining Fates collection boxes, there were new Lucario boxes, and many collection boxes that were pretty difficult to get in the UK. However, there were some places that we weren't that lucky with. It seems to be a bit of the Pokemon section. I mean, this must be a uh, off day where there's literally nothing. There's like a darkness ablaze ETB, but obviously, as you can see, it's, it's pretty locked. But there's a two pack blisters, which I don't think we get, which is like one Vivid Voltage and one Fusion Strike pack. Um, you can actually get like penny sleeves here as well, which is pretty cool. But other than that, I think we've come at a pretty bad day because it seems to be pretty, pretty empty. Oh, We've got to get this right. <laughs> oh, I effed it. <laughs> we'll be here for about four hours. I could have bought my four out right you by now. <laughs> oh, 
Last chance saloon. So after that little Pokemon hunt, we decided to head back onto the road and make way to our final destination. However, before we got there, we had to make one crucial stop. Now this is Pokemon Radar and Don Diego. Now these two have some insane Pokemon collections. So you know we had to go stop by because they had sealed vintage booster boxes, graded cards, they had Charizards, trophy cards, and just a load of stuff you don't usually get to see that often, which is awesome to see and even hold some of the trophy cards. But we couldn't stop there long. We managed to record a Poke podcast episode but then had to head out we finally made it <laughs> i think that is the box oh my days it has taken so long to get to this moment and we're about to open it i've honestly been like just imagining this scene in my head for so long <laughs> there it is there it is, the base set booster box. My favorite set of all time. I finally have this in my collection. I literally grew up on this. I, I, it just brings me back to when I was a kid, opening up these packs and hunting for my favorite card, the Charizard. Oh my days, this is literally, I can't believe this is here right now. So guys, the journey has finally made an end. We finally got the box, it's right here. Now I do wanna say that myself and Pokey Chloe are going to be opening this because we wanna show and experience it with you guys trying to pull some of the amazing cards from my favorite set. Um, so we're gonna be doing this on my channel on the 12th of June. It is a Sunday. Be sure to come hang out if you are new, be sure to subscribe so you do not miss this because this is going to be one of the best box breaks on my channel. I'm excited for this, are you excited for this? I am very, very excited. This has been a long journey, but we finally made it. We've gone all the way to America. Finally got to it. To pick this up. <laughs> so we will see you very soon. Be sure to check out Chloe as well because we've had an amazing journey in America. We picked up some crazy it's stuff, been, which- It's been a great time. It's been, it's been expensive. It's been very- it's been very expensive yeah. so we're going to be putting videos up on our channel so be sure to check it out we will see you next time we finally have this and peace